You're sitting in your living room scrolling through your phone when suddenly a news headline pops up. Nation X just tested its most powerful nuclear missile yet. Your heart skips a beat, you pause, and it dawns on you that somewhere out there, underground or hidden deep in the ocean, are weapons capable of wiping out entire cities in seconds. But which ones would rank as the deadliest? Which nuclear missiles stand at the absolute top, but not just to threaten, but to send the message to the world that some powers cannot be ignored? Today, we're counting down the top 10 most powerful nuclear missiles in the world, and trust me, by the end, you'll understand why global stability hangs by a thread made of uranium, plutonium, and political tension. 10. Agni V, India Let's begin with Agni V from India, a country that entered the nuclear club relatively late but has managed to advance its program at an incredible rate. The Agni V is India's ICBM, which can reach targets over 5,000 to 8,000 kilometers away, depending on its payload. Agni V was developed by the Defense Research and Development Organization, marking India as a truly strategic power. It's road mobile, meaning it can fire from hidden locations, making it more difficult to detect or destroy in a preemptive attack. While its warhead capacity may be smaller compared to US or Russian missiles, the power of Agni V lies in its precision and mobility. It's India's deterrent message, don't test us. Number 9. M51, France France might not always be the headline in any nuclear discussion, but let's not get it wrong. Their missile technology is among the most advanced. The M51, developed by Ariane Group, is a submarine-launched ballistic missile deployed by the French Navy. It has been upgraded several times with the most recent version M51.3. The range of operations is approximately 8,000 to 10,000 kilometers, with every one of them carrying between 6 and 10 independently targetable warheads. It's deployed aboard France's Triumphant-class submarines, and unlike older models, the M51 uses advanced guidance systems called Astro Inertial Guidance System with extreme accuracy. France may not boast the largest arsenal, but their strategy has always been quality over quantity, and the M51 family represents that philosophy perfectly. Number 8. Trident 2D5, United States and United Kingdom Let's continue at number 8 with a name that almost sounds elegant, Trident 2D5. But do not be fooled by this calm title. It is a submarine-launched ballistic missile, meaning it is fired from beneath the ocean and is invisible until it is too late. Developed by Lockheed Martin for the United States Navy, it is also in service under the Royal Navy. The Trident II has an approximate range of 12,000 kilometers, or 7,500 miles. Each missile is capable of carrying up to eight nuclear warheads. Each one may independently be targeted, meaning one missile may strike eight different cities in one single launch. And here's the chilling part. These missiles are always at sea hidden aboard Ohio-class and Vanguard-class submarines, silently patrolling the world's oceans, ready at a moment's notice. The Trident II isn't the newest, but it's one of the most reliable, accurate, and survivable nuclear systems ever built. Number 7. Minuteman III, United States It may sound like something out of history, but the Minuteman III is very much alive and dangerous. The Minuteman III entered operational service in the 1970s, and since then has undergone numerous modernizations. It remains the linchpin of America's land-based nuclear deterrence capability. With an approximate range of 13,000 kilometers, the Minuteman III has the capability to carry up to three nuclear warheads. And for an older system, it is amazingly fast and highly accurate. Today, nearly 400 Minuteman III missiles remain operational across the United States, buried deep in fortified silos across the Midwest. The U.S. Air Force plans to replace it with the LGM-35A Sentinel soon. But until then, Minuteman III stands watch, one of the world's most reliable nuclear guardians. Number 6. DF-41, China Now we go to China, where the DF-41, alternatively Dongfeng-41, maintains its status as one of Earth's strongest ICBMs. This missile has been developed to reach up to 15,000 kilometers, or approximately 9,300 miles, which is roughly one-third of Earth's circumference. In other terms, it may reach any point of the globe from the continent of China. Each DF-41 can carry up to 10 nuclear warheads, each one independently targetable. 
It's road mobile, can be launched from silos or rail systems, and is considered China's ace card in global nuclear deterrence. The message from Beijing is clear. If anyone tries to threaten China's sovereignty, they have the reach and firepower to respond anywhere, anytime. Number 5. Hwasong-18, North Korea Few countries are as secretive about their weapons as North Korea, but in recent years, they've shocked the world with a leap in their technology. The Hwasong-18, a solid-fueled intercontinental ballistic missile. Unlike earlier liquid-fueled designs, the Hwasong-18 can be launched quickly. It reportedly has a range of over 15,000 kilometers, theoretically capable of reaching the continental United States. There's debate over just how accurate or reliable it is. But one thing its successful test flights prove is that North Korea is no longer a minor player. The Hwasong-18 ensures attention is paid, whether they like it or not. Number 4. R-36 M2 Voevoda, Russia The R-36 M2, in its NATO designation as the SS-18 Satan, is one of those names that instantly sends chills down your spine. Developed by the Soviet Union and still maintained by Russia, the R-36 M2 is a silo-based ICBM that can carry up to 10 massive nuclear warheads, or a single warhead with a yield of up to 20 megatons. For context, the bomb dropped on Hiroshima was about 15 kilotons. The largest warhead this missile carries is over a thousand times more powerful. Although it's an older design, the R-36 M2 remains one of the most devastating weapons ever built, and many experts say that only Russia's newer Sarmat will surpass it. Number 3. Bulava, Russia Coming in at number 3, we head back to Russia with another submarine-launched ballistic missile, the RSM-56 Bulava. It was designed to be the sea-based counterpart to Russia's land-based missiles and is deployed on Bore-class nuclear submarines. The Bulava has an approximate range of 9,300 kilometers and is capable of carrying up to 10 nuclear warheads, each with the capability to adjust its course mid-flight. It boasts a high resistance to missile defense systems, using unpredictable flight paths and advanced countermeasures to ensure that even if one part of a defense grid spots it, it's already too late. The Bulava represents Russia's attempt to maintain a second strike capability, meaning even if the country were attacked first, their submarines could still launch a devastating retaliation number two, RS-28 Sarmat Satan II, Russia. And here it is, successor to the terrifying SS-18 Satan, RS-28 Sarmat, or Satan II, as NATO calls it. A behemoth of a missile, weighing more than 200 tons and boasting a range of more than 18,000 kilometers, it is able to carry up to 15 nuclear warheads, including hypersonic glide vehicles that can change course mid-flight to evade missile defense systems. That means even if you detect it, you can't necessarily stop it. Russia has described the Sarmat as invincible, capable of striking any target across the globe from any direction even over the South Pole, a route most missile defenses don't cover. Whether that's propaganda or not, one thing's certain. It's designed to remind the world that Russia's nuclear might is still unmatched in sheer destructive potential. Number 1. Avangard, Russia And finally the missile that arguably changed warfare forever, Avangard. Unlike traditional ICBMs, which follow predictable arcs, Avangard carries a hypersonic glide vehicle that flies at speeds of over Mach 20, that's 20 times the speed of sound, and is able to maneuver mid-flight around any known missile defense system. It's not science fiction. It was successfully tested by Russia and entered into service around 2019. Each Avangard can carry a nuclear warhead with a yield of up to 2 megatons. At that speed you wouldn't even know it's coming, from launch to impact minutes. This has completely changed how nations think about nuclear deterrence, because once something moves that fast and that unpredictably, there's almost no defense against it. Avangard isn't just a missile, it's a warning. So, there you have it, the 10 most powerful nuclear missiles currently known to exist. Each one is the product of decades of engineering, politics, fear, and human ambition. They represent not just destruction, but also deterrence a dark balance that somehow has kept the world from tearing itself apart. It's a strange thought. Peace maintained not by kindness, but by the constant reminder of what happens if peace fails. And just maybe that's the real power of these weapons, not in their blast radius or range, but in the silence they keep, or the unspoken agreement no one wants to break. If you found this video eye-opening, 
make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications because we're diving deep into the world's most advanced military technologies. And trust me, what's coming next will blow your mind. Tell us in the comments which was the most shocking missile to you. The hypersonic glide on the avant-garde or the ancient yet terrifying Satan II? Let's discuss this. Until next time, stay curious, stay aware.